Hi friends, so we're here for another workout. I believe this is workout 13. This is called Build Your Body Workout. It's 20 minutes in length. So what I've decided to do is work a little bit heavier in terms of weight. The kettlebell that I'm using is 20 pounds, but don't be afraid to go even heavier if it's not challenging enough. We're doing 10 exercises, 45 seconds on with the 15 second uh, rest so we can transition from exercise to exercise because we do use a little bit of equipment today. Um, but like I said, make sure the weight is, is heavy. You have to remember that because I'm talking and encouraging through the workouts, I could probably challenge myself with a heavier weight if I was just doing it on my own without talking. So make sure you've got that heavy weight so you're pulling, pushing through um, and working through your failure. Failure means, by the way, that the last couple reps of each set are going to be um, extremely difficult without compromising your technique. So set your timer for 45 seconds on, 15 second rest. There's 10 exercises. Um, we're gonna start with a pistol squat and uh, I'm gonna start with my bad leg first. So with this exercise, you wanna be sure that you're only using the TRX or whatever you're using for support as just a little bit of support. You don't want to use a ton of upper body. 95% leg and just a tiny bit with the TRX. You want to make sure that your knee doesn't cave in. Completely straight. Visualize that you're sitting down on a bench. So your back is straight, your chest is up, the weight's through your heel, and you don't want to look like this. So you really want to push. 90 degree angle. You don't need to come down all the way. That's actually rest. So shake it out. And we'll do the other leg. This is my stronger leg, so I'm going to use this even less. So the knee should never go over the toe. Okay, you're compromising your technique. So you may not even need this. Okay. 
Grab your heavy weight, as heavy as you can handle it. You're gonna place it on the shoulder. Nice big, deep squats. Squeeze at the top. So if you only have little weights, you can make this harder by adding a jump, okay? Or slowing it down. So you're taking all the momentum out. Make sure that the weight is equally distributed on the right and left leg. And you're coming up each time. Full range of motion. Squeeze. I'm going to lighten my weight. This is good for the core, keeps your cardio up. Slight bend in the knees, tuck in your pelvis. Standing figure eight. So, eight to 10, perhaps 12. Your goal is to keep your arms straight. So the straighter the arm, the harder the exercise. You're not using your lower back. So if you're swinging, Lighten, your, lighten the weight. Exercises are much more effective if you do them properly. Feel on the shoulders, you get tired, bend the arms. Okay, so resting. See if you can keep moving. Okay. We're gonna do the left side squat. Placing it on the other side. Here we go. Keep pushing. Remember, you can add the jump. You can slow it down. You can add pulses. Whatever your intensity and your energy is today, it's a 20 minute workout. They're short, quick, and intense. So you have to work to your full potential. Okay. So I'm gonna lighten the weight again to eight pounds. Drag the dumbbell across the mat and add a push up. Keep your core strong. So you don't want to open up, you don't want to open the hips. Other leg. 
picking out folks. Protecting my knee. You can also hold the weight in your head. Have a partner throw the ball back and forth. Create a little more tension. Back one, flip the row. 
Corsair. If you don't have a Turex. We're gonna finish strong. We're gonna add a jump. Do it the whole first time. Thanks for watching.